hey hey what's up what's up i want to welcome y'all back to my channel um if you're new here don't forget to press the subscribe button and don't forget to like share and comment i always appreciate that um but you're in the news with your girl camilla Banks. you're in the news and i'm gonna keep with you yeah you right in the news now um we have i'm not gonna hold you long so we have surgeon Sue's Pepper from Salt and Pepper for 676k, uh, a non-payment of booty surgery. Now, Salt and Pepper, the star Sandra Denton, is being hit with a new 676,000 lawsuit over alleged unpaid plastic surgery work, in particular booty replacement surgeries. Now, Media Takeout News has learned. This is her here. Yeah, so top Beverly Hills plastic surgeon, Dr. David Saya, is asking Denton to cough up the 676,675K for his services. Now, the doctor filed a lien on Peppa's current lawsuit against the Uber over a car crash she was in last year. Now, according to the court documents that Media Takeout News obtained, that the doctor claimed that Peppa got multiple booty replacement surgeries and never paid the bill. He's basically saying she skipped out on the bill. Um, here's another picture of her too. Now, um, the doctor claims that in 2019, he gave Peppa uh, a series of costly procedures to remove a bunch of injections and implants that Denton had inserted into her buttocks previously. Now, here's a picture of that. Now, but Peppa is firing back. She filed a neg negligence lawsuit against the doctor claiming that he pressured her into unnecessary procedures, which caused her butt to harden up. Now, according to Peppa, the doctor originally, originally, he convinced her to replace her butt implants with smaller implants. Now, she claims that Dr. Saya also performed liposuction on her that went bad, which forced her to have another corrective surgery. Um, now, Peppa is reportedly uh, close to settling a multi-million doctor a million dollar lawsuit against Uber for a July 2018 car accident that she had. So yeah, um, she had a car accident, which was back in uh, 2018. And um, it's a multi-million dollar lawsuit. So that's what the this doctor said. I went in and put a lien on that proceeding. So he's like, whatever she gets off of that, he wants his money off top. And I probably, whatever the court costs, has cost him and all of that. Um, now, if you don't know who Salt and Pepper is, Salt and Pepper, they were back. They was like one of the first rap group girls that I can remember out back in the 80s, the early 80s, you know what I'm saying? Like early, mid 80s. Um, they came, their hit song was Push It. That's what song really put them out there, push it. Um, but it was a group of three girls. It was Salt, Spinderella, and um, and Peppa. So Peppa is the one being sued um, over these booty surgeries. But um, they were they were a group. They were the first, really the first rap girl group out that I can remember. You know what I'm saying? Other than like MC Light and maybe uh, Queen Latifah. You know, back out in them them days. But Salt and Pepper was like one of the first ones really out, you know, hands down. Um, but this is so unfortunate that she's going through this. As soon as she's finna get this money, now here comes a lawyer, now here comes a doctor saying she unpaid him, which she probably didn't pay him because she felt, probably felt like the services he gave her was not up to her standards. She said that she had to go back and get things done extra, her booty heart and, um, and all of these sorts of things. So I guess that's, she's trying to, and she also had a liposuction that he did that she had to go back and get done over. It wasn't done correctly, but it still doesn't mean that you don't have to pay for the services rendered. 
uh, you still probably have to pay this man for the services that he did do. Even though you said it wasn't right, the booty hardened up, the lipo section, you had to um, get that done over behind them, but you still have to pay people uh, for, that ser for their service, if that makes any sense. Um, and it's, it's just like this, you know, with the surgeries, um, I've been doing research on them, um, but it seems like um, you, you're in a lot of pain, and not only are you in a lot of pain, but after that, after a while, it looks good, but after a while, you have to get get it done over. Like, it's, it's, it's a redundant process, and I don't, you know, I don't know if it's really worth it to go through it, but I guess they say that you know, the results be nice and everything, but I, I don't think I would want to go through something, you know, that's so hurtful, that's so painful to your body. And then all these things happen. It's so many risks with these surgeries, you know, um, liposuction, getting fat sucked out and then sucked somewhere else. It, it, I don't know. I don't know if it really, um, I don't really know if it's really good for your health. Um, but yeah, she's going through a lot, so um, just keep peppering your prayers. Hopefully, she can fight it. You, I don't know. You know, drop in the comments below of what you think, you know, sh should happen. You know, as far as the doctor not being paid for services rendered. Um, for, do you think she's right because she's saying that he did things that were wrong? She had to go back and get them done over. So, I don't know. It's just all up in the air right now. So, um but anyway, I just want to let you know that the song that you hear playing in the background is by yours truly. That song is streaming on all major platforms. It's um, the Lord's Prayer. Um, yeah, go ahead and stream it. Help me out. I put the link down in the bottom and as well as the other song that I have out that's streaming on all platforms. This I Am God's Greatest Creation. I'll put that in the link down too. Um, if you would like to donate, I'll put the cash out down there too. You can do that too. Um, and I just want to tell you, you're on the news with your girl Camilla Banks. You're on the news. And I'm going to keep you right here in the news until the next time. Peace.